Right, so now we continue from day zero of 10 days of statistics and today we are going to be talking about weighted mean. This is going to be a very, very short uh, challenge. So basically we are calculating the mean, but this time the mean is weighted. So we are given the X, which is the array, and we are given a corresponding array of the weights. And then we are going to calculate the weighted mean. Weighted mean is simply given by this formula multiply x by w and divide everything by the sum of w. I'm not going to be using my whiteboard. I'm simply going to uh, So I'm not going to be using my whiteboard. I'm simply going to solve it uh, because it's really very easy. So basically you are going to return uh, need to check whether they expect us to return or to print. Uh, they want us to print. Okay, so the mean, I'm going to calculate the mean is equal to, um, so it's going to be the, yeah, so again I'm going to be using least comprehension. So I'm going to calculate x, uh, x bar. So I'm going to create a new list of x multiplied by uh, w. Okay, so uh, to write this code, I'm going to just use one important con uh, um, construct in Python or a, a method in Python called zip. So I'm going to zip across the tool. I'm going to create a new array called a bar is equal to an empty array. And I'm going to now zip across the two. So I'm going to say for a uh, for a b in zip. Uh, zipping across x and w, I'm going to now uh, a bar that append, and I'm going to append a times b. All right, so we now have a new array called a bar right here. Okay, so I'm going to now uh, calculate the mean. So I'm, call, I'm going. I'll call this w mean is equal to. Uh, it's going to be uh, sum of a bar uh, divided by sum of uh, w. So this is basically what the make, uh, weighted mean is all about. I'm going to return it as a float. So I'm going to say prints round of w mean uh, to one decimal place so this should be fine so I'm going to put D here okay so this should be it so I'm going to simply run this code to see what we have and you can see it passed the test case I'm going to just submit this code as well and it passes the four test cases as well so I'm going to be stopping here and I would also like to remind you to subscribe to my channel if you've not subscribed and also leave me a comment if you have any comment for me. I remain kind on the tech pro and I'm always there for you.